Hey guys, make sure to stay until the end. We'll explain about common mistake people make when replacing fuses and relays that can end up you spending quite a bit of money on diagnostics to parts that you may not need. Make sure to stay until the end. Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Ford Explorer of that generation here from Europe 2011 to Europe 2015. If you need to find where the fuses and the relays for the IAT sensor, that's practically the intake air temperature sensor, fuses and relays, where you can find them. If you need to buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping, that way do not waste money and time. We'll put a link in the description of the video below for your convenience. Please check it out. So let's start on it now. So before we start, let us tell you guys a little bit about us. Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. We take them completely apart. We show you how to fix engines, transmissions, um, engine lights, transmission lights, fuses, relays. Why we do all that guys? Because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep making these free videos. By the way, check out our YouTube channels. We have guys more than 15,000 free repair videos that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs. So let's go ahead and start on it now. So the IAT sensor, intake air temperature sensor, fuses and relays, what you can expect to find them guys. Okay, what do we need to do? We'll work in two fuse boxes. The first one we need to open the driver's side door. Come in the footwell compartment. If you look, that's a parking brake panel. Behind it, if you look upside down on the left side in the dash, you will see a black cover on the side on the left side. Press these two tabs, pull the cover out, you'll find a fuse box with a layout like this one here. Before we continue, let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses, not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys, when all you have to do, test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay, different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out so guys here what we need to check so if you come here guys okay we need to check one fuse then we need to go to a different fuse box and if you come in that row of fuses that fuse number 18 that's the fuse that you will need to check then you need to open the hood once you open the hood that's on the driver's side that's the car battery next to it is the main engine fuse box press these two tabs pull the cover up you're going to find a fuse box with a layout like this one here guys what do we need to check now multiple multiple fuses one of them fuse number 67 right here okay all these are for main engine management so we need to check all of them 68 69 right here will need to be checked then you need to check fuse number 86 right here fuse 90 and you need to check relay 66 right here. All these fuses and relays will need to be checked if you have problem with that component. So guys, by the way, you have all kinds of different fuses, relays, circuit breakers, and check under the hood. It's even more complicated, guys. And even you have some special fuses, okay, like this one right here. One time we needed a replacement fuse, we couldn't get one, and we were stuck in the middle of nowhere because of that. We'll recommend to buy some, put them in the glove box for a peace of mind. We'll share the link in the description of the video below for your convenience, where you can get them at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste money and time. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.